The Game Compact Simulator offers a versatile and convenient way to practice and improve your shooting in an efficient way wherever you are. Make sure you're ready for reality. Being part of the Aimpoint group, we at GAME know the importance of training as a hunter. To run the GAME Compact system, you require a Oculus Quest headset. So either Generation 1 or as we have here, the Oculus Quest 2. You transfer the uh, simulation software from your PC onto the headset. After that, this is all you need. So this provides the tracking and offers a 360 degree shooting experience, which offers you the opportunity to practice at shots that might otherwise be difficult to do. We attach the hand controller to the rifle. This gives us a very precise tracking of your barrel movement and we know exactly where you release the shot. The tr trigger mechanism has been designed to be as close to a reel as possible and we Bluetooth pair it with the headset for a very precise tracking. So once up and running, this is all you need, making the system very mobile and easy to use and you can bring it anywhere. So once you're up and running with the system, a good tool to start improving your shooting is to use the SimPro module that's included in all the game packages. So Stefan here is going to help us to show what you can see and how you can use the tool. So you see the overall menu. Here we can select to practice at static targets or animal targets. So we can both shoot static on the animals or we can practice on running game. You can have select the speed and distance and also once again the 360 de degree shooting experience so you can choose whatever direction you want. So it's a perfect tool to see how speed and distance affects shooting at running game. So once you've made the selection, press play and then we can take the shot. After each shot taken in the Sim Pro module, you can review it in the analyzer tool. So here we see the shot, we can see the barrel movement. So you see how you enter the target, you swing through the target, release the shot. So the blue circle indicates where the shot was released. The red arrow is then where the shot hit the target. So this clearly shows how the lead is affected by speed and distance of the running game. So playing around with distance and speed in SimPro is a very good exercise to understand your shooting and a good exercise that might be hard to do on the shooting range. After having used SimPro to fine tune your technique, you can move over to the different hunting scenarios. So there's different hunting scenarios for different animal types and different environments. So this is a good way to test what you've just practiced in SimPro in a more hunting-like environment. Animals will appear randomly from different directions. They will have different speed, come at different distances which is a more hunting-like environment. There's also hunting rules to consider, like forbidden shot angles, uh, there might be animals that are not allowed, and you need to consider backstop and so on and so forth. After each hunting session, you will have the complete summary of that session. You will also be able to watch the full replay of each shot and see where you place the majority of your shots. The session summary gives you feedback on the scenario. The heat map shows where you tend to place most of your shots and you can also do a detailed analysis just like in SimPro. Thank you for watching and make sure you're ready for reality.